G'day. Welcome to a very exciting course, Permutations and Combinations, how to understand them by not doing them. In fact, here's the normal question that drives people absolutely batty in a traditional Permutations and Combinations course. Does order matter? That causes so much brain ache and woe, my advice is never ask that question. So in this course, let me teach you a way to think about all those typical counting problems and never have to ask yourself, does order matter? It's irrelevant, permutations and combinations, they're not different objects, they're exactly the same thing. So this course will explain exactly what I mean by that and how to make all that work so much more natural and easy and simple as beans. So in this course, we'll even go beyond that. We'll play with various ideas like Pascal's triangle and binomial theorem. For example, some people might not know, Pascal's triangle rises in many strange places. For example, the powers of 11. 11 squared is 121. 11 to the 1th power, that's much easier, is just 11. 11 to the 0th power is just 1. 11 cubed is 1, 3, 3, 1 it turns out to be. 11 to the 4th power turns out to be 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. And there is this triangle of numbers called Pascal's Triangle. In this course, we'll make perfectly good sense of what's happened just there. We'll even come up with formulas for the specific entries of the triangle, all in a natural and easy way. We'll never ask, does order matter? It's all just natural. We'll also talk about the binomial theorem and so much more. So we'll definitely do all the traditional stuff that one needs to know. We'll make it easy and straightforward. Never ask this question. And we'll go even further than most textbooks go with this stuff in a very natural and comfortable way. In fact, so this course is structured as follows. If you want a sneak peek of what the general basic approach is that makes this all ridiculously easy, go to lesson 1.1. This is a very quick overview of what the approach is. And then thereafter, lessons 2 and lessons 3 go through the mechanics of permutations and combinations, never making a distinction between them, and mechanics of Pascal's triangle and all the work there. It's a lot of fun. Make sure you look at the text under each video, so that each lesson is structured with a video, and then a whole bunch of text so you can work through it slowly, go through a lot of practice examples and so forth. Scroll down, make sure to scroll down after each video, see that material. And this companion guide to this course, which has all the text printed out for you, plus all the solutions to all the exercises if you want to check your answers. Great stuff, let's get cracking. This is natural and easy. Let's get rid of that question from our lives. Ah, awesome.